According to music historian Rico Stover, this extremely popular Spanish classical guitar piece was transcribed and possibly even composed by Antonio Rubira around the 1850s. The first publication actually occurred in 1900 in Argentina. And since then, it's been played by thousands of guitarists thousands of times all over the world. It's appeared in concerts and theater productions, obviously audio recordings, uh, radio, television, and more. One interesting fact about this piece is that nobody actually knows who wrote it, although most historians seem to point to Antonio Rubira as the probable composer. That said, you may have heard that Narciso Yepes, another classical guitarist, wrote this piece. He actually claimed authorship of this piece around the 1950s, but he wasn't born until 1927, and since this piece was written before 1900, probably not. Another interesting fact about this piece is that it has multiple titles. It's obviously known as Romance, but it's also known as Spanish Romance, Romance de Amor in Spanish, Romance de Amor in French. It's known as Romance de Rubira, pointing to Antonio Rubira as the, as the possible composer. It's known as Estudio, Estudio en Mi de Rubira, Romance of the Guitar, Romance de Guitarra, and many, many other names. And unfortunately for the author of this piece, but very fortunately for us, this piece is also considered a public domain work. So it should be pretty easy to find it on Google. You can find tabs and sheet music pretty much anywhere you want. But I actually wrote my own version of this with fingering and tab that you can download in the description below. So you don't have to go searching for it. In this video, I'm gonna play a slight variation of the arrangement of Romance that most people have heard. That's because I'm gonna add an interlude between the major and the minor sections. And that interlude is a study that was written by Francisco Tarrega called Estudio en Mi Menor. So with that said, here is Romance.
If you like this video, then you're going to definitely want to check out this video here where I discuss and perform El Vito by José Despiazo. And if you want to check out a slow and close-up version of Romance that includes the interlude that I played today, you can check that out in this video over here.